Hello, everyone. I, I, I was going over Facebook and YouTube, like I do, uh, but I was also, I uh, visited uh, my mother-in-law and sister-in-law and family and uh, took my granddaughter uh, a new bicycle and we had a conversation and it made me realize that a lot of people are having problems or, or, or have a an issue of some sort with the term new normal and I've seen this a lot online also Facebook they 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 want to get back to normal and they don't want a new normal <laughs> and I get it it's it's and they think it's new it irritates a lot of people that this phrase new normal it never bothered me and I integrated it because I understood it to mean I, I, the phrase used to be social paradigm a new social social paradigm uh, but they've shortened it we've shortened it the internet does what it does and shortens it the new normal and I I was explaining that we have them all the time uh, we have the internet now we're never going to go back to not having the internet this the internet is the new normal that is normal every day it used to be fringe the internet used to be crazy weird only nerds used it and then there were cell phones. Cell phones were super expensive, could only make phone calls. And now we would never go back. Cell phones, cell phone use, is the new normal. So we have new normals that most people, that almost everybody, is now comfortable with. Uh, most people don't want to go back to normal. They want to keep the new normal, uh, the internet. They don't want to go back to normal of having pay phones uh, and, and you know cords on the phone. They, they like the new normal. This new normal, though, with the pandemic and police violence, uh, police brutality, is getting into new normals that are more uncomfortable. And it's uh, telling, can't see my expression, there we go, okay, I'm good. Uh, the new normals that have, that have happened in the past with particularly the internet and cell phones are rushing in faster new normals. Uh, not so much with the uh, coronavirus or Ebola, which apparently is rising its ugly head again, and in uh, leadership the way it is now, there's 100% there's chance Ebola's coming here. Just uh, wrap your brain around it. That'll be the new normal for that. Uh, so not so much that, but the police brutality is more of a, a focused or a uh, an effect of a previous new normal. We wouldn't have this rioting uh, without cell phones and the internet. Uh, all this police violence was, has been going on the whole time. Police violence, violence and brutality isn't new. Uh, just ask any brown person in this country it's not new uh, and also it's not just brown people uh, there's police violence against uh, wh whoever that particular of uh, uh, asshole police officer didn't like uh, there's police violence against uh, their ex-wives or ex-girlfriends uh, not so much against ex-husbands but I'm sure it happens <laughs> it's mostly men it's testosterone is an ugly hormone um, so there's, it's, it's not just uh, blacks. Uh, police, br police brutality has occurred uh, in trailer parks, the trailer park trash. Uh, if you remember, uh, uh, Dukes of Hazard was all about Boss Hogg <clears throat> using the sheriff to try and frame the Duke boys and their Uncle Jesse to get their farm. They were trying to steal their farm by framing them for crimes. Now, in reality, they would have just killed them. <laughs> Oops, he had, I saw a gun. So police brutality is, is ingrained in our culture. So it's not new. What the new normal is, is since everyone has uh, cell phones, and cell phones now come standard with cell phone cameras, there's video footage of it, and it's in your face. You can't ignore it anymore. So the new normal 
is shit's getting exposed. Uh, a lot of people don't like the term new normal. There's terms I don't like. That's the way it is. There's food I don't like. I still eat it. Uh, so the new normal is going to happen faster uh, because of previous new normals. And uh, uh, if you don't like the term, I'm sorry. But my, my goal for this video was to, to help you cope and understand, at least in my perspective, what the term itself, new normal, encompasses. Social paradigm. Change. I heard a, a quote of, uh, the only thing worse than change is no change. I don't know who said it. Change is happening. Peace. Stay safe.